Warning. The content on this channel is not intended or suitable for minors below 13 years of age. If that is you, please click off and come back when you're older. By continuing beyond this point, you affirm that you are 13 years of age or older. What's up out there, swears? It is time for a new installment to a series I like to call Under 10 Games. Now, the premise here is pretty simple. The games are under $10 each. They can be on sale or whatever. It's I'm only using Steam, so I don't wind up going to like a used game shop and just getting something that's like under 10 bucks. So these are only Steam games. And the second criteria is that they have to be interesting, to me anyway, in some way. And today's game is Abandon. Now, this game was free on Steam. And it's not super highly rated. So, this may be something that also shows up in the one and done playlist where games that... Um, I don't want to particularly partake of again. How do you guys like that? Particularly partake of. Anyway, so where the games that are just not hitting to me wind up in that list, so you guys can see those. They're all, this is a, this is like I said, free, which is under $10, so it is in the under 10 list. It probably, if it's as bad as everybody says, will probably also show up in the one and done list as well. So, all right, let's go to the game. We are at the title screen here, and it looks like there is some stuff going on. Can we look around? You got a guy on the floor here. You got a play quick. Let's see what more is. So, let's use it something. Sprint, crouch, WASD as usual, P is pause. Does not look like we have a space bar. All right. So let's go back and let's just play this. So the idea here is, <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, prepare to be abandoned. So we're just gonna be abandoned. All right. And. What the fuck? I thought it froze. Oh, Jesus. I don't know. What does he mean? Okay. So apparently we wake... I don't have control of this yet. So apparently we wake up and... Nothing going on. So let's look around here a little bit. Here's a bed. This is really dark. Is there a light switch in here somewhere? There's a light switch. Let's go see if we can turn it on. Can I not turn it on? Do I have to focus on it? Well, this is funky. Okay. Whatever. TV's on. Got a light on over there. It's over here. I wonder if I can, let me see if I can invert, no, I can't. I want to invert the y-axis because, um, what's in here? Crouching. Nothing.
Hehe. <laughs> can I... Look at all this power wasting. Let's see, can I get to that? Uh, I still haven't figured out how to use objects. So where did I come? Okay, I came from that room. It's over here. Oh, am I still crouching? Oh, yeah, I yeah. am. Oops. Sink. What did I just use? The phone? Oh, God. Hey, can I get a drink? Thirsty! Okay. Where's that light that went to the garage? Or something? Somebody have a messy poo? A messy poo? Did somebody have a messy poo? So, alright, so I woke up in here, I guess is how this goes, and I think I would like this better if I could turn the lights on. Whoa, what's this? I guess I left. Oh, I'm in the garage, okay. Did I just come right back in? What the fuck? Really? Did I go here? Oh. What's this? Hey, that shouldn't be an option. Okay, there you go. That's bloody, okay. Knock, knock. Can you see this? God damn it, what the fuck? Really? Oh, that's where I came in.
Oh, for fuck's sake, are you serious? Is it this? This is a serious pain in the ass. Yeah, maybe. Is it? Oh my god. Well, you have to keep looking. I don't think I do. Is it in the toilet? You know, this shit is really tiresome. Whatever. Alright, where's the tool thing? Yeah, there it is. Fuck, just do it. Shit. Yes. So if I was a fucking key, where would I be? Oops. Dude, you don't just find it. Fuck. Like, we need that? We need that discussion? This is where I came in. Yes? No? Okay, apparently we have to find the key. Let's game! Fuck that key. What is 
is going on in here? This is gnarly. Seriously not on here? Like where else would you keep keys? Come in these boxes. This apparently is a furnace. It's supposed to be scary, right? And instead, it's just annoying. Fucking gotcha scares and shit like that. Cheap. Oh, what's this? Oh, over here. So this is just like you literally just wandering around until you can find the fucking object. Me too. <laughs> oh my god. Really? <laughs> this is so fucking dumb. Hey, can I pry it open with the laptop? Cell phone, clipboard. Why is this? <sighs> I guess I can go back to the shelf full of stuff. He's broken in and I'm thinking that won't work. There. Yeah. Oh my god, there's more. So is this just like a really bad escape room? Is that what this is? More shit I gotta find in this tunnel. Too much to ask for it to collapse on me. So where does this come in with abandon? I'm really baffled by this. I mean it's this is fine, you know. Us running around and fucking about in here, but how is this abandoned? Understand that part.
You know, every time I see these guys, I always think, who is running around lighting all this shit? I mean, is that somebody's job is to run up and down these fucking halls lighting a bunch of torches? Is that is that like the job, the, the torch lighter guy? <laughs> I was just curious. No, I'm not in control again. I don't know what's going on here. I cannot make this out for the life of me. Now where am I? Here, just do it. Use it. Just use it. Use it. Okay, guys, I'm about done with this. If, if, this, if this is more looking around for keys, I'm, I'm out. As it is now, this is not a very interesting game. Somewhere where it's raining, it sounds like. And it has electricity. Oh my god, this is so ill. Oh wait, is this something I can do? That is. Where even am I? I want that set of shells. Can I bring it home? So where did I come from? I came in here and... From where though? Did I just fall into the roof? Am I supposed to crouch? Can I... I don't understand what focus. I haven't had to use focus at all yet. Here we go. <laughs> All right, so you have to find stuff before it'll, it'll let you look for shit like he's. I guess. Oh, my God. Okay, guys. So I'm done with this. I am completely finished. And, uh... You can do this spooky music. In fact, I actually know you can't because it's annoying. But I, I'm, I'm just finished with this. If I don't find this by the time I'm done saying goodbye, then this is done. Uh, so I can see why this is not a very well-rated game because there is not a lot of any. Oh, is it? I came up. Okay. This th this whole let's make everything dark is just annoying. It's not spooky, it's not scary, it's just stupid. And it's very, very tiresome. That's the thing here is, like, I'm not saying it's easy to make a game, but if this, if the game is just like this, where you're just running around looking for stuff, and it's completely black, not a lot of enjoyment to that. For me, anyway. Like, why don't I just blindfold myself and try to play? Okay, fuck this. Wait, hang up there. So I'm going to stand in the pile of trash. Here I am. Stand in the pile of trash. And, like, I think parts of this are okay. But, I don't understand where it's abandoned. You, you wake up somewhere. And the TV is playing static. And there's no electricity, I guess, or something. And you're wandering around to get out for some reason. And, like, there's just an absence of everything. So that, that's a mystery, right? There's nothing. You have no idea what the fuck's going on. And that's, so there, it's like a bad dream or something, maybe? I don't understand why they're going with this. 
Generally, if you're abandoned, you are probably at least somewhat cognizant of where you are prior to being left, I would assume. And, you know, or if you're stranded on an island or something like that, there's more of a backstory other than this whole survive the night thing, which is just, it's it's got a vague FNAF sort of reference to it, I guess. And maybe that's what they're, I, I don't know what they're doing here. Just, all I know is that this pitch black shit is tiring. There's not, you know, there's not a flashlight or a way to turn electricity and stuff. And wandering around in the dark trying to find random objects is tiresome. So I'm going to say this is not a game that uh, I found enjoyable at all. And I would not say anybody should go play it either just because it's... Like, the payoff is just, for me, it's not not really existent. Some of the textures look okay, but I think this needs to be a little bit more realized as to what it's trying to do. And ideally bring the player in that so they have and at least an idea why they're fucking about in the dark the whole time. So, anyway, this is not a fuck this game, and this is not two red hot pokers in the ass. It is a thumbs down. Very, very, very definite thumbs down. Way down. So, uh, yeah. So this is going to go on one and done also. I'm never playing this piece of shit ever again. If you guys like it, I guess download it. It's free. You know, whatever. So, uh, anyway, there's the uh, there's our look at this. Uh, feel free to like, subscribe, all that kind of stuff. Uh, I'm on Twitter. You can come follow SwearGaming666 on Twitter. Or you can follow me on Steam, which is where I found this steaming pile of shit. We'll see you next time. Adios.